the Mac tool. Molly got a lot of vips in the house this weekend. Last week, Doug Coletta was running a special Coletta Motorsports scheme. Actually, Coletta Air. Because Coletta Air is expanding and they are hiring. You a pilot? You in the aviation industry? You looking to maybe make a move? Swing by over there and talk to Doug Coletta. Drop off a resume. They are actively seeking help at Coletta Air as the company continues to expand. Tony Schumacher driving for a new team owner. Joe and Kathy Maynard, Maynard Family Racing. They've got Okuma on the car. This week, Joe and Kathy took over the majority interest in the team just a couple of weeks back. Promptly went to Seattle. Promptly went home with the trophy. I told Joe at that point, I said, you need to sell. You could be the only guy in NHRA history to retire undefeated. Bought a team, won a race, got the heck out. He said, no, I think we're going to hang around for a while. He and Kathy have got a real, real affinity for NHRA championship drag racing. And, you know, they are aligned with the winningest driver in top fuel. Tony Schumacher in the right. Doug Coletta in the left. Doug is now down in the bottom half of the field. 3.74 is only 11th best. On a cloudy day in Brainerd, you better be able to run 60. Three point seven three two. Three point seven three two. Three hundred twenty nine miles an hour for Doug. Now that's going to move him up a couple of spots to number nine. But I guarantee you, you can tell by Alan and Brian's expression down there. They want a little bit more. And Tony Schumacher did not get cleanly down at four fifty five and one hundred sixty two. We'll take another look at that one up on our NHRA TV replay here. So a couple of them have hit it and a couple of them have missed it just a little. Watch the Okuma machine left side of the screen. Right there, spun the tire. Tony's out of the throttle. Doug's car was solid. Doug's car was stuck. Doug's car just wasn't quite as fast as I guarantee you they wanted it to be. Interesting to note when you watch the cars out there in the middle, especially from that far end camera, it is a real battle between centrifugal force and the downforce created by the wing. If the tires break traction, the back of the car will jump up because the centrifugal force will throw the wing up, and you see that before you even see tire smoke. Austin Proc and his team headed back. We'll get that Montana brand. Rocky Mountain Twist Car ready for qualifying session number four. They currently sit in the number seven position with a 370.